company. Companies like PayPal, Apple Pay, Google Pay are fintech companies. Zinique has built everything on the blockchain. So I think this is a step higher. And I will explain exactly what Zinique is doing and what kind of products they have. Uh, the marketing, the building of the community is done by the company Safir. And together they are building an ecosystem for finance and investments by connecting fiat and crypto. As I said, Zinig is a fintech company based in Dubai. And the meaning of fintech is a combination of financial services and technology, exactly like PayPal or Apple Pay or Google Pay is doing. We got different other companies, for example, M26 or Revolut. These are the future banks. It's not a bank like we know, but it's a fully online bank. They're all fintech companies. Fintech, financial services, technology. Technology is done by Zenique itself. Own programmer team, a huge IT team, has built their own blockchain. This is very important. It's the own blockchain. It's the Zenique blockchain. It's not using another blockchain. On this blockchain, a lot of uh, products and a lot of, how do you call it, instruments, minting technology, a decentralized crypto exchange, an application, digital payment software, and a tokenization platform. Tokenization is, I think, a different model as the stock exchange, but now on blockchain. Good. This is the technology side. There's a lot of more coming on the side of the technology. But if you want to be a fintech, you need somebody or a company who's doing the financial services. And this is done by our partner. It's our cooperation partner that is a fully licensed bank in Dubai. That's the reason I think that Zenique is also in Dubai. This bank is an investment bank with more than 500 million funds, but very unique. They have also a crypto fund. So crypto friendly banks, you cannot find them much on the planet. You can read everything on the ocs-finance.net website. This is a fully licensed, regulated bank by the Dubai Financial Service Authority. So all the banks in Dubai are being licensed by this institution or authority. They are working with partner banks in Europe, with the ENG Bank is from Holland, the Julius Bar is from Switzerland, and the Postbank is from Germany. Locations in London, Frankfurt, Zurich, Vienna, Moscow, Hong Kong, Singapore, and Sydney, and very soon also in Istanbul, in Turkey. So all kinds of products, all kinds of services, what a normal bank is doing is a partner of Zenik. The founder of this company, or the founders, but the, the main founder is uh, Christian Turner. He's from Swiss, uh, Austria, I'm sorry, from Austria. And our founders are also from Austria and Germany. So the CEO, Mr. Erwin Doctor, the chief operations officer, Dr. Dr. Michael Offner has got a double doctor title. Then we got the Germans, Erik Heinemann, Jan Bollmeier and Maxwell and a huge IT team. Okay, so blockchain. Uh, when I heard about blockchain, uh, I was always thinking that it was just Bitcoin. So sending coins from A to B. Um, but it's not, it's more. Blockchain is not just coins. When you listen to the CEO of Binance, that's the biggest crypto exchange on the planet, he says that blockchain will have a more significant impact on the world than the internet. So how big is internet? A blockchain will be bigger than internet. This is also what he's saying. So, and I think that the proof is on the right side, you can see all those companies, all those brands from banks and finance, from logistics, from health, insurance, energy, real estate, government, uh, travel. You can see all those brands, they are all using blockchain technology and they have nothing to do with cryptocurrency. So blockchain is more as just cryptocurrency. Blockchain is the future of putting data safe, uh, saving and, and, and a lot of things more. So you just have to Google. So blockchain is important, but now the Zenic blockchain, what is so different on the Zenic blockchain, I think that, that you have to understand why there are so many coins on the market and they are not successful. Thousands of coins in the market, one month, five months, six months, and they're gone. Why? Because nobody can use that coin. You can use it, but uh, by just, just changing it, but you cannot use it on the market. And when there is no usage, the coin will never ever have success. And that's the problem, I think, because there are so many projects on the market 
yeah, ICOs, IEOs, a lot of other things, they have a blockchain, okay, and more, nothing. They have a wallet, that's it. More, they don't have. They have a debit card where you can put crypto, but you cannot use it somewhere. Or, or they have a mining technology, or they have a minting technology. So, so many projects, but everybody's doing something. And when you have a coin and you can use it only in one platform, for example, you get, you get money and you can only buy tomatoes. So you cannot buy 31 days tomatoes. So you need something, money, where you can not only buy tomatoes, but you can buy everything. And then you have a usage. And this is Zenique. Zenique has got its own blockchain with a technology what nobody has. And around this blockchain, they have built a 360 degree crypto economy with everything what you need as a crypto freak. They got a blockchain, they got an application, they got a debit card, they got a decentralized crypto exchange, two ways, it will be a swap and it will be an exchange. They got a hub, that's a technology where you can mint your coins. So that's the new version of mining, I think. And Zenit tokenization is a finance instrument platform. More is going to come and on the whole thing, they got the Zenic coin because it's a Zenic blockchain. And then you have got something what is very powerful. I will explain you more. So the Zenic blockchain, this is the heart of the system. It can work across the board like Ethereum, Tron and Binance. What does it mean across the board? So very simple explained, you got Ethereum and Ethereum can communicate with other blockchains by wrapping the, the coin to a token. Wrapping means you got a coin, and make a jacket and then you can communicate with that exchange or with that blockchain i'm sorry everybody's using the technology wrapping but when you wrap a coin there is a problem when you have a decentralized crypto exchange i, I will i will explain this later the zenith blockchain will be the first blockchain who can create everything what i've explained without wrapping and this gives us the power on the whole planet to be the first real decentralized crypto exchange of its kind, because no more wrapping is required. This is amazing. And I want you to understand what I mean. Go back to year 2007. We got a lot of mobile phone companies like Nokia, Ericsson, Sony, Philips, and a lot of more. They are all using the same technology. And then in 2007, a company came with another technology, and that was the iPhone, Apple. And we all know what happened with all the other companies. So Zenic blockchain is like the iPhone on the crypto market, coming with a technology what the others don't have, and this is going to change the whole market. Good. And all the things what I've explained, this is going to servers and to support the main product of Zenic. that is tokenization this is new yeah you can google tokenization i will try to explain it very very fast take the model of stock exchange in your country you got a stock exchange the most well-known stock exchange is the nasdaq in the us and on the nasdaq you will find companies listed like apple microsoft google twitter facebook all tech companies are there so why a company is listing on a stock exchange because they are going to finance the company, finance the projects. How does it work? They list, they sell shares, they collect billions of money from people who bought a share. They make companies, only the bigs are on the stock exchange. But it's a beautiful model to finance your projects, but not everybody can go on the stock exchange. And now take this model, copy and paste it on the blockchain. Then you have tokenization. Take the shares, what they are selling, put it on a blockchain. You get a digital share. That's the token. That's tokenization. And now, do you know what you have? You have got just one platform, but you can service the whole world in one time on one exchange, and you can create a project finance for big, not big, for every company on the planet. Do you know how big this market is? So all the real estate projects you can tokenize on the whole planet, all the solar plants or wind power plants projects you can tokenize, you can tokenize art or paintings or antique, or if you have a patent, you can tokenize license, 
um, everything you can tokenize. And this is going to be, I think, the future of the new generation of financing. Because the forecast of the World Economic Forum says that in 2027, that's that's in five years, I think. Yeah, yeah almost five years. It will be 24 trillion US dollar, not billion, trillion, a thousand X. The total finance instrument is 800 trillion, so 24 trillion in just five, six years is amazing. And what is 24 trillion? You can buy 74 Googles. Yeah, good. So tokenization and the whole thing needs users, customers or users. And we want to have multi multi million so hundreds of millions of users customers for everything we have the whole platform and to connect those users or customers we need an application because that's the fastest and the most safest thing what you can have and that is the zinic app but this is not just an app it's a decentralized wallet you can put crypto on it more than 100 cryptocurrencies you can put on your wallet it's decentralized on the blockchain safe um, you can also put normal money on that. You can do in real time fiat and crypto transactions. You can do crypto and fiat payments online or in the shop on the POS terminal. So you can go to the Starbucks and pay with cryptocurrency there. And of course, your smartphone is going to be connected with the minting. That's the that's the producing of coins hub. And so you produce, send it directly to your smartphone. There are coming a lot of more functions in this application. It's like Google Pay or Apple Pay, but now with uh, crypto on it, well, a lot of things more. So this is going to be, I think, the app of the future. Good. Now, let's have a look on the coin itself, the Zinic coin. Why it's a Zinic coin? Because it's a Zinic blockchain. Yeah? The coin is already listed on the number one and the number two decentralized crypto exchanges, that is Uniswap and PancakeSwap. So you will are listed on an exchange. Okay, you can buy and you can sell the Zini coin already. That's the token there, but you can do it. We got a couple of instruments, not we, but everybody has got a couple of instruments to help the coin to increase in price. That's how many coins you have in the market. So we have limited amount of coins. Uh, how much are you going to mint with limited amount of fully minting power, so um, maximum amount of, of minting machines will be somewhere between 450 and 500,000 customers, not more. When you have a minting machine is done, yeah, so many so many machines we don't have. We have annual halving two times, um, and an instrument what is very unique, we got also a profit distribution of our crypto exchange. So in other words, I will explain it, 100% of the profit of our crypto exchange is not going to Zinique, but it's going to be shared with the community. It will be our exchange. You can get weekly paid from the profit of that exchange. And this all is going to be connected to the Zinique coin, like all the tokenization projects are going to be connected to the Zinique coin. And Ethereum ERC20 means all the ICOs, IEOs on Ethereum, that has created so much power for Ethereum. That's the reason that Ethereum is now more than $4,000. Take away all the ERC-20s, you don't have Ethereum. So the Zinique blockchain can do the same. We will have the Zinique coin, and we will have all the ERC-20. It's not the ERC-20, maybe it's the Zen-20, I don't know, on that blockchain. So I think that we can have the same power or much more powers ethereum because we got much more things what we have to do yeah so this is going to be the zinic coin and um, the zinic exchange 100 percent profit distribution this is very unique this exchange is going to be the first decentralized crypto exchange of its kind not because it's customer friendly, because it will have the best exchange rates, free transfer, even verification, very low fees. Fee advantage if you use a Zinic coin, it's like the BNB on Binance, it will, the Zinic coin will be on the Zinic exchange. We are going to use our stable coin, the Euro coin, uh, and we want to be in the top 10. Not because we are very friendly, of course, but there is another reason. And I want you to understand this. Look, it's a little bit difficult, but I will try to explain. If you have a crypto exchange where you can buy and sell coins, 
you have two versions. One is centralized and one is decentralized. The technology centralized means it's built on a computer. Decentralized is built on a blockchain. What is built on a computer, you can hack. You can close it. The money can be disappear. That is a computer. But when it's built on a blockchain, it's safe and nobody can hack it and it will stay forever. So my question to you, what do you want to have if you have $100,000 of coins? What do you want to park your coins? On a computer or you want to have it safe on a blockchain? Everybody will shout on a blockchain. Okay, no problem. Are there decentralized exchanges? Yes, of course. Look, the number one, Uniswap. The number two, PancakeSwap. They're doing a billion sales volume per day. They're huge. But why so many people are using centralized exchanges like Binance or OKEx or BDC? Why? Because if it's a decentralized crypto exchange, it has a problem. And now this Uniswap is built on the Ethereum blockchain because that should be should be used a blockchain pancake is built on the binance blockchain and this is a limitation on uniswap you can only list ethereum coin and tokens because it's an ethereum blockchain it's like a language uniswap is just speaking spanish so all the other coins you cannot put on uniswap if you want to have other coins and you want to change you have to go to a centralized you have to go to binance so this is uniswap and pancake is much safer but you cannot put all the coins on it so what is the solution the whole crypto world is waiting for one solution and that is we want to have a decentralized crypto exchange so please build it on an on a blockchain because we want to have it safe i don't want to lose my money but i want to have like binance all the coins and tokens and that doesn't exist till zinig is going to start next year in the first or second quarter with the first decentralized crypto exchange compatible to all coins and all tokens because we are not using the technology wrapping so what do you think is this the iphone in this market yes or no like 2007 we will have much lower fees because we're not using an expensive ethereum blockchain we've got fast transactions because we have now already 12,000 transactions per second we can bring it up much 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 higher all the tokenization projects imagine stock exchange on blockchain worldwide all the, in every country every project what is going to be financed is going to put all his tokens on this exchange and um, we will have so many customers here because every coin every token what you put on this exchange is safe because it's on the blockchain and now the last thing what if this was your exchange what if you could get paid every week because of all those transaction fees this can be millions and millions per day like all the other crypto exchanges but this is going to be huge because we are going to have 100 percent profit sharing with the community and how you can get paid per week you just have to own the zini coin and keep it in your wallet that's all and the reason why we're doing this is if you take the Zenith coins from the market and you put it in the wallet, it's not in the market. So the less coins on the market, the most, the more people are asking the coin, ask and demand. So what do you think? What can happen with the coin price if there are millions of coins, not on the market, but somewhere in a wallet? This is why we pay you. You get paid for those Zenith coins, what you keep in your wallet and not in the market. So then the question is, how many shares you want? Because every Zenith coin is a share on this exchange. You have one or 10 or 100,000 or a million Zenith coins. It depends on how many coins you have. So how you can get Zenith coins? Very simple. You can buy it on the exchange or you can be one of the most exclusive customers at the moment because it's limited of our minting hubs. This is the technology. It's a processor. It's a chip which you buy. And this is producing your Zenith coins every day.
And it depends on the capacity of the chip. It's like a small computer and a big computer. So a small one, you can buy it already for 100 euro. It will produce very small amounts of Zinni coins. When you buy the full hub, it's 1,499 euro. It's producing about five Zinni coins per day. So it's 150 coins per month. Uh, a lot of people are buying two of them or four of them or eight of them or 16 of them because every coin you produce is your share. And we have also a physical product. We need these physical products as the master note that the security, this is doing the same as the housing hub. So the same capacity of minting, but in this physical product, we have got also a chip that's a hard wallet and it looks like an iPad, it's like a computer. It costs about 1000 euro more. It's doing the same, but this product, we cannot deliver it at the moment outside of Europe. And, um, I think that there is a, a chip where we're waiting for because of the chip problems worldwide. Also, the car industry is uh, shocking with that. I think we can deliver those products starting uh, end of November somewhere. I don't know exactly. But if you ask me, if you just want to mint by just the housing hubs, it's a chip. It's working for you daily. How does it work? It doesn't matter which product you buy. The next day, you get a back office from us for free. And the next day, you can go in your back office and you can search for your mintings. Someday, one, two, three days later, the blockchain will connect automatically to your minting hub. It can take a couple of days because it will, do, uh, it will connect automatically. So one, two, three days, I don't know. And then it starts to use your chip and it's minting. And every time when it's using your chip, it's paying you the, for this. And that's the Zini coin. Look at this. This, this customer has produced about 109,000 Zini coins. It was 17,000 euro. Today, because the coin price has increased, it's more than 30,000 euro. And it doesn't matter how much you have, it's daily income. You go in your back office, you can take the produced coins immediately out. So every single coin which you have, you see it in your back office. It is on the blockchain. You say, give me my coins. You get it. You keep it in your wallet. It's a share or you need money. You sell it the same second on Uniswap. So in other words, I am producing about two and a half thousand coins per day. I can take it out. It's 750 to 900 US dollar a day. I can sell it every day in Uniswap. It's about $800 every day. Daily income with Syndic Minting. This is the first time that I have seen this that you produce a coin, a unique coin, and you can change this immediately on Uniswap and you got Ethereum for this. So this is real income. Good. I'm almost finished. So I just want to close this with the last slide and then I'm jumping in the business plan. I wanted you to understand that this is not just a project. This is something what is huge. This has started since 2018 to develop the whole project with the blockchain, with everything around it. This was so unique, and this is so unique, that a fully licensed bank has said, I want to invest in this technology. It's like investing in Apple or Tesla from many, many years ago. This is similar. And... We are just started now actually to build the community. We have got the app now in the market. We got the tokenization started. The Zinique debit card is coming, I think, in a couple of weeks with crypto and fiat on it. Um, and then we will have two exchanges. One is a swap. It's like Uniswap that will come first. And after that, we will have the real Zinique exchange. Both are Zinique, of course. And then we will see what is going to happen when the whole infrastructure is starting to grow. And then you will see what is happening with the price of the Zinique coin. Don't look at the price now. That's not a, a real price in my eyes because we are not trading, we are not buying, we are not selling, we don't have tokenization, we are not um, payments, etc. So, but it's about 30 cents on Uniswap and um, on PancakeSwap is more than a dollar. So what is happening when this starts? Good. And we will have also something something different. It's a university of Zenique where, where a lot of people can get the education about blockchain and crypto with a real bachelor MBA certificate. And more is going to come. Good. Now let's finish with 
how you can make money with this business model. Because <clears throat> I studied industrial engineering and marketing in Holland, and they teach me a lot of uh, information about franchising. This is not a franchise concept, but do you know what is the power of franchising? Like hamburger franchising or pizza franchising. There is a company who has invested millions and millions. They have something which you cannot do. They did it for you, but you can use them. You can use a part of that technology to be a franchise partner of that. So you are using everything what they have, the image, the power, the investment, the technology, and you can make money with this. So I'm comparing it this with Zinik. Zinik is not a blockchain. Uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's a blockchain. Zinik is not um, a franchise. But the model is similar, I think. So they have something in their hands. It's like Tesla or it's it's like um, what else? Like, let's like Apple. You have something what nobody has. And the only thing what you have to do is help us to build a community. We need total five, 450 to 500,000 customers who are minting our coins. They get paid with our coins. And every coin what they mint, and I would 30 cent, but what if the coin is in $1 or 100 or 1,000 or 4,000 like Ethereum? And you mint every day five coins. I'm not saying it's going to happen like this in the price, but why not? Tell me a reason why it's not going to happen. And therefore, we got a compensation plan. Why? When you bring us a customer who is buying the technology, and he's producing your own coins. He has bought a hardware. He has bought a chip. And the money which he's paying, 69% of that, we're going to share with our business model. This is it. How? In three ways. Unilevel, career bonus, whirlpool. How does it work? I'm not going in detail, but let's see. Unilevel means you have your own customers you get 9% because it's your first level. These customers, you will see it, they will automatically share this brilliant product with other people. It's not a cream. It's a hub which is producing you a daily income. And maybe that coin, I don't know, can be huge in a couple of months or years. So they share with other people. They buy, they mint. They take out, they sell, they say, wow, it's working. They share with other people. So do you know what's going to happen? This is going to duplicate in hundreds of levels. And on the first 15 levels, with a total of 53% payout, you can make hundreds of thousands of euros. I made, and I know a lot of people who are making that also. But this is not all. This is just your first income. It's all about how much volume is happening in your uni level, in your team. 100 euro, 1,499, it doesn't matter, everything is a volume. So if you have volume already in your teams, then there is also number two, it's a career bonus. For every volume you reach, plus first lines, plus 40% rule, you get a career name, it's Ruby, double Ruby, Sapphire. It depends on the volume what you have. 10,000 can grow up to 50 million. But now, listen, every time when you reach a certain volume or a certain career, you get a bonus. The company says, thank you very much. You reach Ruby, you get 300 euro. When you reach the 20,000, you get 600 euro plus, so you, you'll have 900 euro. But very important, in network marketing, which we know, you make a volume in this month, at the end of the month, they pay you a commission and then they set it on zero. So the next month you start with zero volume, you have to build up again. And then again, next month, again, here, nobody's taking away your volume. This is so amazing good. When you have 10,000, the next is 20,000. It's not 20,000 new. It's you have 10,000. It's 10,000 more. So you do the same, seven customers more. But every time when you reach the next level, it's all accumulated. And you can do this in the next 100 years if you live so long. But there is no time limit. But look at the numbers. It starts with 300, 600, but it goes up to 300,000 plus 500,000, plus 1 million, plus 2.5 million. And when you make the accumulated volume, you get accumulated career bonus up to 4.6 million euro. Okay, ask me, when did you start? I started the half of May. Where are you now? I'm almost six months in this company. 
I'm now double white diamond. I reached this in five months. In two weeks, I will be gold diamond and they're going to pay me 1 million euro. They have paid me already all these career bonuses. It's about 1 million, 100,000 euro. Next two weeks, you will see my back office, boom, 1 million euro. So at this, I built in six months, yeah, less than six months. Good. But that's not finished. This was number two. And the number three is the world pool. World pool means the whole world sales every month, 10% goes in this pool. Now, listen, it's the same volume. It's the same career. But look at the careers. Every career had got a star. One, two, 10, 20, 500. It means shares out of that pool that month. Good. How much is a share? It depends on how much is the volume and how many people are being qualified to get in. So the last five, six months, is when the average was 200, this month was a lot of people who have entered in the pool. That's okay because that's brilliant because it means that a lot of people are getting career in this business. We ended somewhere about 139 euro. So it's not 200, it's a little bit less, but I have seen 139, 250, 363. So this can change, but let's keep 200. I didn't change it because I think the next month will be higher. When you are a rupee, you get one star. It's one times 200 euro this month. But when you qualify for the whirlpool, you will get it six months. So the next six months, you will get one star. And every month when it's 200, you get six times 200. When you go to double ruby, so you reach 20,000, you get two stars, it's 400. Look, when you reach 100,000 euro volume, it's 70 customers of 1,499. That's all. It's a team volume. It's not your 71st lines. You are Sapphire, you get 10 shares. It's about 20,000. I'm sorry, six times two is 12,000 euro, which you get every month, 2,000. And then you can build it up. When you're diamond, you get six months that money, um, double diamond, triple diamond. When you go to the top, it will create a massive income for you. Good. I'm ready. I'm done. I want to thank you for your being here. You have questions. I know it's fast. What you are going to do now is call the person because there are things that are coming. It will be shocking you tomorrow. I will use that slides. We got already two huge companies. One is switching from the Binance blockchain to the Zenith blockchain. And one is switching from the Ethereum blockchain to our Zenith blockchain. Yeah. So this is Ethereum and ERC20. We have got on the Zini blockchain the first crypto projects which are switched to our platform. We got a partnership in Austria where you can have the Zini coin on all the ATMs there. And we can pay with the Zini coin by shopping and getting cash back, etc. So that's a new partner. So we are starting now a little bit, a little bit. So that's the reason that I'm saying 2022 is going to be shocking good. Till that time, please produce as much as you can your Zenit coins. And how to buy as much as capacity on the hubs what you can have produce the Zenit coin. And the reason is I made a huge mistake 10 years ago. Look, I've studied industrial engineering and marketing. I'm speaking four languages. I'm more than 33 years in this business. I have traveled the whole world. I got mega connections. And 10 years ago, my, my friends came to me because they thought that I was intelligent. And they said, there is something on the market and they call it Bitcoin. It's a cryptocurrency. I said, what? They said, a Bitcoin. I said, who's the company owner? Who's the CEO? Where's the company founded? How much money they have invested? How is the software working? They said, there is no company and there is no CEO. I said, come on, guys, this is a scam. Finish. I never, ever asked the question. And after 10 years, when I see where the Bitcoin is, if I invested or bought for 10,000 euro Bitcoin, I was multi, multi-billionaire. I made a mistake not buying the coin. I made a mistake by not asking the questions about that coin. 
Because if I ask the questions, I would get answers. I will find them. And then I would be, 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 be investing in that project because the risk, maybe for 1,000 or 5,000 euro, but I missed. Because at that time, nobody could tell me maybe about what is going to happen with the Bitcoin. Because if somebody is telling you today, the Bitcoin will be $10 million, what do you will say? I said, no, that's not. Maybe it's going to happen. But today, today we are in a different time. Today we are in 2021. We know what is cryptocurrency. We know what is blockchain. Look what these guys have made on blockchain. We all know what is the future. And we all know also that there will be stronger coins as Bitcoin and Ethereum. Because Bitcoin is not fast. It's not powerful. It's nothing. You can do nothing with Bitcoin, but it's the mother coin. We all know that. The Ethereum, Ethereum is not fast. It's not cheap. It's got a huge platform with all the ERC20 project. That's it. Zenik can do much, much more as Bitcoin and Ethereum together. Much more. It's just a matter of time of exception. You have to accept this. The market has to accept this. If we bring this technology like the iPhone in 2007, and we will bring this next year on the market, now big companies are coming to us. We had a meeting in the Burj Khalifa uh, in the Armani Hotel with 200 VIPs. We got multi-billionaires in the room. We got persons from the royal family in the room. Those people, they didn't came to watch just blah, blah, blah. Why a bank has invested, why a bank is partnering this company? A bank who's got a license is not going to risk his license to jump in an advantage, adventure before they have tested and do the due diligence. So who are we to say, hmm, does it does it fit? if a bank is partner in this. So this is just what I'm going to tell you. You have got questions like me had 10 years ago, but don't make the mistake what I did. Ask your questions today to the person who's invited you. Because what if you could produce thousands of new coins with the technology and in two, three years, you see the price of the Zini coin walking down on the bottom of your TV. And it's a high price. So I want to thank you. Tomorrow, we're getting now more than 200 people. So thank you very much. Tomorrow, same time, the same presentation, the same information, but everybody's inviting five people because you can change the life of those five people. It can be your friends, it can be your family, it can be somebody you don't know. It doesn't matter. Show them this business because we get limited amount of minting machines. Thank you very much. I'll see you back tomorrow. Ciao, ciao.